So a little while ago, I did a video on the ICOM SHF project. ICOM have been dabbling a little bit with 2.4 gigahertz and 5.8 gigahertz uh, SHF unit. It was, a uh, prototype was released at the Dayton Hamvention a few months ago. And coming up at the Tokyo Ham Fair 2022, tomorrow on the 20th of August, uh, it was due to be released, but we've had a leaked photo and I thought that I would share that with you today. Now, just to recap on some of the things that we do know about this unit, ICOM Japan have been tweeting out over the last week and a bit uh, some photos here and you can see the very first one that they released here, you'll be very surprised. So just think about that very surprised for a minute. Um, just looking here quickly at this unit, obviously it looks like an IC705. There's some... Um, it uh, looks like some connectors in here. One thing I noticed was AV in and AV out. That was something that, that caught my eye. Uh, USB-C, it looks like there too. Potentially, it could be USB micro and a little LAN port there. And I kind of thought, oh, it's just the SHF uh, uh, radio being released. Then they released this one, which is you'll be ultra surprised, which was interesting. So just the wording. So we've got very and ultra. And then we've got two here, uh, outdoor units. It looks like one's daisy chained into the other. And uh, they're obviously using LAN cables. Maybe that's an RF cable as well there. Again, new model, promotional video to be released. Then just scrolling up here, um, then they release this. You'll be super surprised, so very ultra super. And it was a bit intriguing to me. I thought that was interesting. And you can see here that they've blanked off everything except for 2400 and 5600, which we already knew about the ICOM SHF project that they were working on those two bands. Well, just literally in the last hour and a bit, uh, this has made its way onto social media. The ICOM IC905 SDR, VHF, UHF, and SHF radio. So now, again, this isn't confirmed because ICOM, are due to, ICOM Japan are due to confirm this tomorrow at the Tokyo Ham Fair. Uh, the time that they had on this was... Uh, 0110 UTC. So there is a video that they are going to release and I'll put a link in the description below to that video so that you can watch the release there. But it looks like this thing is going to do, it looks like here on the photo, if you can see there, 144, 430, 1.2 uh, gigs, 2400, 5600 and 10 gigs. Like it's um, one thing I did notice somewhere... The 10 gigs has got a little asterisk next to it, so I'm not quite sure what's going on there, but it looks like ICOM have made an, I, an IC905 radio, which is exclusively for VHF and above, which looks really, really cool. Now, I'm wondering whether this radio, but the fact that it's got 2 meters and 70 centimeters in it as well, is that it might be the transverters, the transverter driver, the the radio of all radios for, for people who want to run transverters and microwaves. So you can use it for your existing transverters, but it also comes with these extra bands. 10 gigahertz, there's that little asterisk. I've just noticed it there um, up on the, on the banner. So this is officially the first photo that we've seen of the IC905 released. Uh, we've got a model name, obviously. And a uh, little demo, we could probably zoom yeah, up on this a little bit more. Maybe we can get something else out of it. This looks like the same stock um, demo that they had at the Dayton Hamvention that was running on uh, 5 gigs. So they've got VHF, UHF, SHF, all mode. Um, so it's not just a it's not just a controller. It looks like it's actually a full transceiver. And I'm wondering whether they've replaced... Uh, what what they've done there, maybe it's got a BNC connector on it for, for the lower bands, um, so VHF, UHF, and maybe 1.2 gigs, and then once you get above 1.2 gigs, it starts to go out via this um, POE unit, this LAN outdoor unit. But this looks really, really cool. Um, <laughs> so uh, uh, looking forward to it. ATV, that's another thing which I've just noticed. So we go back to the uh, other... Uh, where is it? The other photo here, which I spoke about, uh, which intrigued me, was the AV in jack. Um, so I was wondering, what's what's the AV in jack? What does that actually mean? But it looks like 
the AV in jack might be amateur television. So you might be able to do amateur television with this. So this this is this is quite amazing um, from ICOM. Uh, that it looks it looks like on the surface, and again, this isn't confirmed because we've got to wait until ICOM release uh, their video uh, tomorrow. But it looks like on the surface that they've taken the SHF, they've listened to hams, they've they've looked at what uh, would work in the radio and what hasn't worked, and it looks like they've developed an all-in-one solution. So this this is this is really really awesome. Um, the fact, the thing that really excites me is the fact that it's got 10 gigs in it at 10 gigahertz. Like there is no, as far as I understand, there is no major retailer uh, who does 10 gigs on um, on uh, using a radio. Icom don't have any 10 gig stuff. Uh, Yaesu don't have any 10 gig stuff. So this will be the first of its kind. Don't know about power levels, so we'll have to look at that. But keep following the channel here. Subscribe. Uh, because I will be doing an update after ICOM release their official video and, and specs on this unit. Um, ICOM Japan, <laughs> this, of course, this, uh, this got re released early. Um, so sorry about that, but I'm really excited and I wanted to share the news with everyone. Um, if this unit can make its way to Australia, we've got an expo coming up in November and we'd really, really like to show it off. We've got a massive contingent of microwave people coming down to our expo in November. So please, 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 ICOM Japan or ICOM Australia, if you're watching this video, please organize to get this down. So uh, looking forward to it. Let's see what happens. Again, the link is in the description below for the release of that video from ICOM tomorrow. So, uh, so catch it. So thank you very much. If you want to learn more about the original SHF project that ICOM have been doing, there will be a link up here into the uh, end screen. So check it out. Good stuff, ICOM. Really looking forward to it.